Hello everybody, welcome back to Fratellino Academy, bro. Listen, with this weather, bro, me, I couldn't pass it up, so I decided to take a field trip to the backyard, bro, right? But, me, I still put on my jacket, because even though we have like 97.8% solarity, bro, it's still a bit nipply outside, okay? So today, me, I'm gonna learn you about French, bro, because, you know, we're in Quebec, and me, I don't feel like being executioned by, like, the language police, you understand, bro? So more specific, we're learning today about... The accent aigu, bro. The graves and everything, bro. Right for the E's. So the first one, bro, is called the accent aigu. All right, that sounds like E, and you mainly use it when you're like conjugationing verbials, bro. Right. I'm gonna give you an exemplification. Basically, it's like j'ai été à mon bas, bro. All right. So like that's that. The middle one, bro, is called the accent grave. Okay. Basically, you're using this one when you're not using this one, and it's like it sounds like eh. Understand. So, another example would be like, bro, ton sach est spaqué. And then you use this. You can even combination them, bro. It's like Legos. You can put them together. It doesn't matter. And then the last one, bro. Salut. Good. Okay. And then the last one, bro, is the accent circumflex, bro. I mean, I thought it was something from the movie The Matrix. But like me, I just call it the ovin, And that's it. This one, bro, you're never going to use it, bro. Your chances of using this are lower than if you were to try to open up a business like right now in four hours on St. Catherine, bro, right? So like, don't worry about this. So I think there's like eight words, bro, that have this. So like, I'm not even gonna give you an example, bro. And that's it. So once again, this is like E, this one is like E, and this one's like E, you understand? And that's basically it, bro. And like, if you don't understand, it's okay. Like you stop someone who speaks French on the street and guaranteed they know this, bro. But once you know this, you basically know like, 95% of the language already, like you're flying, boy, right? So thank you again for listening to Fratellino Academy, boy. If you have any questions, ask your mother, and uh, that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys soon.